Google Maps is certainly one of the most impressive services offered by Google, and in this video we're going to be looking at the update that has recently been made to its mapping service. The first thing you're going to notice when you use the new interface is that it looks very different. The map now takes up the entire of the web page, whereas previously it was a window on the right. The search box still appears in the top left of the map, so let's use this to run a search for something. Here we are going to be searching for Art Gallery in Manhattan. Several icons will appear on the page and you can click one of these to find out more information. In the window on the left, you will also be given details and an address. Photos and reviews will appear below. You can click on any one of these to get more information. Integration with Google Plus means that there are reviews available from the social network in the maps. You can access Street View by clicking on the image on the left. You will then fly into Street View, another nice graphical addition to the program. Once in Street View, you will be able to use it as you did in previous versions of Google Maps. Now, let's go back to the overhead map by clicking the icon in the bottom left of the screen. Now we are going to have a look at the Earth feature, which is a combination of satellite view, which was a feature of Google Maps previously, and the Google Earth software, which could be downloaded to your computer. Once this is loaded, zoom in and you will see that the buildings have perspective. This is because they have been modeled in three dimensions. To get a better perspective of this, click the Tilt the View icon on the right. This will give you a more angled view over the city. As you can see, the 3D buildings are very impressive indeed. These are just a few of the fundamental changes that have taken place on Google Maps with the new update, and you will probably agree that this is a rather impressive improvement.